This is the book of Micah, chapter 2, verse 10. Arise ye and depart, for this is not your rest, because it is polluted. It shall destroy you even with a sore destruction. Call Halal, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakwadash, that's given all praise to the Most High. In the name of His only begotten Son, in the name of the Holy Spirit. My name is Ibar from the Prophets of Babylon camp down here in Tampa, Florida. And I want to give double honors to the elders and apostles of the Great Millstone who taught us His truth. And truth is sincerity, peace, and salutations to the whole folks scattered abroad. I want to touch on this, this, this video I saw. You know, this came out like last week. And it says, couple who called 911 on a fugitive ineligible for reward. Couple who called 911 on fugitive and eligible for, 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 for reward. So, and I'm going to play the video. Alice couple who called 911 to report a kidnapping suspect was told they are not eligible for a Crime Stoppers reward. He was wanted for kidnapping and raping a seven year old girl. Their 911 call led to his arrest. Fox Sports' Lori Brown has been working to get answers, and she's live in Dallas. Lori. Corey's having people spot a wanted fugitive and then call 911 to report him seems like one of the very reasons the Crime Stoppers reward program exists. But it turns out if you call 911 instead of the tip line, you don't qualify for that reward. We both looked at each other and. And you see, obviously, it's Jake. Okay, it's Jake, man. All right, now if they had been Edomites, they had been, been, been of a lighter complexion, then maybe they would have got that reward. But because they Jake, they didn't get that reward, man. All right, they 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 they, they had they had some some they they pulled some uh, small print shit, man. And then I do this video to, to, to say the fact that we you you we we are not going to get ahead. You will not get a break in this captivity. This is the land of our captivity, and things do not work for us the way we work for other people, man. Okay. And what it was is they probably saw. Oh what? So what? They 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 niggas. Let's, let's make up some shit, you know, cause cause because they don't want to get Jake no damn money, man. They don't want to get Jake nothing, you know, and um, Jake probably you know risked their lives trying to be trying not trying to be the hero, and they get nothing for it. Okay, so let me bring it back. It's like one of the very reasons the Crime Stoppers Reward Program exists. But it turns out if you call 911 instead of the tip line, you don't qualify for that reward. We both looked at each other and we both said, isn't that that guy? The Jordans were coming home from lunch July 7th when they noticed a face they recognized from the news and a Crime Stoppers billboard, 41-year-old Leonard Neal. He had on the same outfit as one of the pictures that was circulating on social media. With six children of their own, the Jordans had taken a good look at the man accused of abducting a nine-year-old boy. So they got six kids, okay? Six kids and they thought they was gonna be able to you know, use that reward money and 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 and, and, and help their family out. Turns out, no. You know, it doesn't work like that. And seven-year-old girl. Police say he released the boy, but the girl was missing for 12 hours. Police say he sexually assaulted her. That could have very easily been our oldest two kids. The Jordans did not just call police. Once Neil got on the bus, they knew they needed to follow it. After getting disconnected from 911, a Dallas police officer called Kenyatta Jordan. And once we turned, made their um, that right on Pope. He said, oh, that's y'all in that, uh, that minivan. I'm like, yes, sir. He said, okay, well, we pulling up right behind you so y'all can get out the way now. Before police arrested Neil, he cut his throat. Police later released this mugshot. I felt confident that it was him, but I just wasn't 100%. But then I let, I let the window down, and I heard him on her scream, and I said, that's him, baby. That's him. So, so the dude was a total psycho, man. This dude cut his throat when the cops came. He was take, you know, kidnapping you know, uh, kids and shit and, 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 and abusing kids. Which also proved uh, go, goes back to the first scripture. You know, this place is not our rest. Let me grab bringing that back. And then, uh, because yeah, man, this the, 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 the way things are set up here in America is not for your for for your part. It says, "Arise ye and depart, for this is not your rest, because it is polluted. It shall destroy you even with a sore destruction. It's destruction. It's like a destruction. And there's a lot of you know, um, there's a lot of." Uh, a lot of um what's the word i just had it took my tongue there's a lot of um starts with a c uh uh damn i had it on top of my tongue 
um, corruption. So like it's a lot of corruption going on. OK, everything is corrupted that, you know, polluted. It, it, it is corrupted. So you may think, oh, yeah, this not third. And this remind me of the video that I did immediately remind me of the video I did of this Jake woman that won a lottery. She won for like a bunch of money at the at, 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 at the casino. She was playing the slots and the slot came down and said she won a lot of money. And then the motherfuckers at the casino saw it was a Jake woman. And they said, oh, it was a malfunction. What? That's your fault. I would have sued the fuck out of there. That's your fault. It's a malfunction. No, it ain't my fault. And it wasn't no malfunction, man. The machine said she won. She won. You know, ain't, ain't that what you go by the damn machine? That, that, that's the whole reason why, why why you got the machine in the first place. But guess what? They say, oh, nah, you you don't, you know, you know it was a malfunction. Because they don't want to give Jake a lot of, you know, money, okay? They said that, that was, there's a malfunction or whatever. And then they, t- they offered her a damn, I believe it was like a, a meal or something like that, a burger and fries, you know, dinner or something, you know? So so, so this is what goes on here, man. And we constantly getting cheated and robbed and spoiled, okay? Later, the Jordans learned about the Crime Stoppers reward that had been offered for Neil, a most wanted fugitive. But when they asked about it, they were told they were not eligible because they called 911 instead of the Crime Stoppers number. Does it seem like a bait and switch? Yes. Yes, okay. absolutely. We dialed 911 instead of the Crime Stoppers phone number. We're not able to get the reward. As police work to build trust with the community, the Jordans say this feels like a breach of that trust. It feels like we were misled. On DPD's website, it urged anyone with information to call Crime Stoppers or 911. Crime Stoppers is operated by the North Texas Crime Commission, a cooperative partnership. Dallas Police Chief Eddie Garcia told us in a statement, while DPD does not have input on the criteria that must be met for a Crime Stoppers reward, when a unique set of circumstances arises, we certainly can open up conversations that will help improve services, prevent crime, or help solve investigations in our city. Thanks. The Jordans so are hoping- pretty much they did their job and they didn't want to co- co- compensate them for it. But if they had did the job, they would have got paid for it. <laughs> that will happen in- Texas is racist as hell, bro. Really, all of America's racist, but this is some racist ass shit. Their case. They should be held to um, their word. I just got off the phone with a Crime Stoppers board member. He said that the rewards are only paid to people who call the tip line based on Texas law. The Jordans believe if they tried to search for that tip line number instead of just calling 911, Leonard Neal might still be on the run. We're right. going to be asking Texas lawmakers if it's time for the statute to change. Right. So there you go, man. And, and that, that was just a bunch of bullshit. They told Jake to, you know, take from Jake, man. Okay. So this is Isaiah chapter 42 verse uh 22 but this is a people robbed and spoiled our people are robbed and spoiled man everywhere where you turn you're getting robbed you're getting schemed you're getting you know spoiled and it reminds me of that movie um that, that i watched the other day uh they cloned tyrone i did a video on it as well and other brothers have done videos on it you should definitely watch it because it was showing you how this devil is doing shit behind the scenes man he had a whole underground fucking bunkers a whole a whole underground labs under the hood man Imagine you in the hood, nigga, just a bunch of underground labs under the hood, you know, and they was doing experiments on Jake, you know, they was doing different experiments on Jake to keep Jake uh, lost, docile, destroyed, you know, and then they was cloning the worst of Jake, you know, and putting those same Jakes in society. So they showing you how, to, how, how they cloning all these Jakes, you know, the worst of Jakes, the pimps, you know, the damn the, the drug dealers and such and such. Those are the ones they was cloning because those are the ones that they wanted to to, 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 to to be in America, man. And that's the product of America, you know. But if you, you know, a family man, if you, you know, uh, uh, trying to be a businessman or or or, or 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 anything different than the stereotype, you know, nah, man, they ain't fucking with you. And that's and this is why these devils will be taken out of power and they will be destroyed. But also, this is also because this is not our rest, you know, and the curses that was put upon us by our Lord. You know, we 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 are not going to. Um, stri- oh, Stop here. we are not going to strive here, man. We 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 are, we we are not going to, um, you know, be, be 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 comfortable here, satisfied. Okay, it's not how it's going to work. It's not how it's not how it's meant to work. 
it says, and, it, and instead of that, you're gonna be, you're gonna feel, constantly feel robbed, tried, you know, disrespected, you know. It says, Isaiah chapter 42, verse 22. But this is a people robbed and spoiled. They are all of them snared in holes. They are hid in prison houses. Now, you got these churches, which is a prison, I mean, which is a snare in a hole. And that movie they showed you too, how they was putting, you know, um, drugs in, in a communion. You know, they showed you how they was, how they was, you know, putting frequencies on the music, you know, to make people act a certain way. It was a scene where they put certain frequencies on the music and they had went into a club and in the club, the, the, the DJ played a song, okay, which, which the DJ was in on it. You know, he was a Edomite with, with a damn afro. He played a song that made everybody, you know, nice and docile when he needed to see who was running through, you know, to try to slow them down. And then when they didn't work on them, you know, he had, he had turned a different song on. That made all the people in the club go after them, man. You know? It made all the people in the club go after them. Pretty much turn, turn them into, into zombies. So they got this technology, but they're doing a lot of weird shit behind closed doors. And they're doing this to destroy you jakes, man. And if you don't identify this and and, 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 and peep game, then eventually you will be destroyed. Isaiah chapter 42, verse 22. Exhausted. It says, they are all of them snared in holes. And they are hid in prison houses. They are for a prey and none delivereth, for a spoil and none saith restore. Yeah, so they ain't trying to restore Jake. You know, they ain't trying to restore. They ain't trying to, you know, make make things right. You know, they ain't trying to, you know, um, you know, make up what they took. Instead, they're trying to take more. You know, it says none said said where where store. It says who among you will give and give ear to this? Who will hearken and hear for the time to come? Who gave Jacob for a spoil and Israel to the robbers? You gotta understand. This is the will of the Heavenly Father, man. That he that he put us in this predicament for disobeying him. But our time is gonna come where we're gonna get the kingdom, man. You know, and, and we're gonna be set for eternity. It says, Did not the Lord Yahweh, he against whom we have sinned, for they would not walk in his ways neither were they obedient unto his law so this happened because what because we sinned against the lord so this is why we in this predicament this is why these things happen this this is why you can never get ahead no matter what you do you can never get ahead because why you are in the land of your captivity okay and we sin against our god so these are the curses driver 28 so like he goes into it but how you're um how you're cursed you know your store and your basket, pretty much everything you put you put your hand to, is gonna be cursed, man. This this is this 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 is a spiritual thing, you know. So Jake try to you know do do something right, you know, and and and, and you still get wrong. It says therefore he hath poured out he hath poured upon him the fury of his anger and the strength of battle, and he hath set him on fire round about. Like you. Yet he knew not, and it burned him. Yet he laid it not to heart. So Jake, you gotta start, you know, put this, put these things, you know, taking some deep thought, man. You know, there's a fire set round about us, man. You know, the this 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 is a part of the Lord's fury and anger. You know, we we have upset the Most High, so He makes it where you 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 know you catching this hell, you know. And I'm gonna grab this real quick too, just just to close out. Okay, this is also why this happens. Look at like I mentioned before. Um, let's go to Deuteronomy in twenty eight, you know. Deuteronomy twenty eight. It says Deuteronomy chapter twenty eight, verse fifteen. It says, But it shall come to pass if thou wilt not hearken unto the voice of Yahweh Bashim Yahushai, thy power, to observe and to do all his commandments and his statutes which I command thee this day, that all these curses shall come upon thee and overtake thee. Cursed shall thou be in the city, and cursed shall thou be in the field. Cursed shall be thy basket and thy store. Cursed shall be the fruit of thy body, and the fruit of thy land, and the increase of thy kind, and the flocks of thy sheep. Cursed shall be thou when thou comest in, and when thou goest out. And it goes on and on. You know, these different curses, man. So this is one of them. You know, this is why Jake can't get ahead. This is why Jake catch hell. This is why Jake be at the bottom. You know, begging for crumbs. Looking for, 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 for rewards that never come. Benefits that never come. You know? And then if you do get some, it's because you got to sell that completely the hell out or you got to be, be a part of the system, you know? If you ain't a Freemason or, or doing some weird shit, 
you know, put, to help put, put pushing forward their agenda, you can forget about it. You know, you got a, you know, the Jake woman with, with the Jake man. They got beautiful kids. You know, they're trying to, you know. Now, if there was a, 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 a mo or something, you know, if there was a, 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 a tranny, it would have been different, you know. But if you, you know, are somewhat in your right mind, you know, you, you, know, you, you can forget about it. They're going to make sure that you don't get nothing because they don't want that vibration pushed in the earth, you know. But that's the point. I'm going to say Shalom, Kwame Shrala, Ababa Ball. We are yet to stay in our captivity, man, under these curses and uh, in our hell. Shalom.